I got myself some more nice pallets. And uh, of course, Angel has to check them out. And Gracie has to make sure Angel's doing her job. Uh, I don't know what's going on with Honey. That hay net was put out for them last night. And they didn't finish it. Probably empty it later. Uh, anyway, I have to move this hay from here to here. And that's what these pallets are here for. So I can build a level platform to store the hay. Because my guy is uh, on the verge of getting ready to finish out the barn. There'll be a storage room here and the roof will be extended. So it'll be a nice peak here and the roof line will be not as steep as this one but it'll be extended out another 10 feet. So that will give me quite a bit of roof, roof surface for uh, doing a rainwater catchment system. Uh, between this and the cabin and anything else I build. I plan on having a rainwater catchment system for the birds as well once I get their coop done. But I had to put that on hold because I got to get the hay moved and I got to set up this platform so that I can put the hay here so I can run electric around it. Of course, right now I'm not letting the horses out because everything is so dry. So, it just means I gotta feed more hay. But. Like a bifocal it's really hard to judge looking down at my feet that's level or not okay and I know there's a slope here but I can't tell how much so I gotta do this pretty much by feel over here uh, that's where there's those stone stairs and I don't want to go past those stone stairs. I want to stay right here. Okay, I've got a nice corner here with the electric fence and I can fence off the hay from the horses if I decide to let them back out in the yard again. That is pretty much dependent on whether or not we have any rain. And this hay will stay stacked here 
until the barn gets done, and then it can get back back in there. So this is just a temporary situation here. down and I'm only going to be stacking what is outside the barn. I'm not going to unload the loft. If need be, I have another pallet here and I can bring down another pallet from up above and I can put two more pallets out here. But uh, I think that's all I'm going to put here for right now. And uh, we'll see how well this works. One tarp down, one tarp to go to go back up. I need a hammer. Obviously, my brain was not on straight yesterday. I bought a six by eight tarp instead of a 10 by eight. Well, I just have to do the best I can. I'll take it from the corner Bring it over this way. And hopefully we don't have a problem in the middle. And hopefully he gets the roof up sooner than what I expect.
well. I don't know if you could see that on video or not. But as always, safety first. I made sure that I had my cat and my dog supervising to make sure I didn't do anything stupid. Too bad they weren't with me when I bought the tarp, right? <laughs>